damage our chuck apart and see if we can get it to work again. Been cleaning up all the bits that came with the edge work cutters and that. So I'm black as usual. So give it a good grind down first with the wire brush and then we'll see if we can get it apart somehow. Put a PPE on first. There we go. Yeah, I can give you before and after for the shot. Still got this bits to clean. I think I did clean it once before already because it was really rusty, but it was sort of before and after there. Look, and get the chuck, get the jaws out, and get them really cleaned up well. Put this thing back in to action. Right. Yep. I think I'm going to see if I can unbolt it. Some funny size. Well, I think we'll have to go mess it. About 16 miles. I think it worked well. 18 mil. I want to hold it in the vice up. Let's 
Oof. That's oof. That's oof. Jump the sword. Box, you can open it. Box, you can open it. Box, you Я сейчас на сапуш. That's quite big bolts. Box as well. The box of studs. Studs. Oh, it's a bit of a food head. This is going to come off.
That's as clean as we can get it just now till we get the, the jaws out. Get some bullies in. I don't actually have a key to turn it, I'll have to go and make something in a minute. Just get some WD in the cracks. All the jaws are numbered, which is good. Not in the right place. Vice again, and then so watch this vice because when you go past a certain point, the freaking loop mechanism lets go and it's a pain to get back in. Mm. Quite cleaned up. I'm gonna to to get a tool for here. Uh, got WD in there now, and if we can get that turn. We might get the jaws out. See, they've got numbers here. One, I think this is two here, two and three. I think they'll move together on these, don't they? So, next job's trying to find something to fit that. I've got this broken boring bar and my wee wee spanner. Would you believe stuff's moved? Was moving. It's going the wrong way. It's coming. I mean, that's moved a long time. This boring bar yesterday tried tapping a hole and then the tap broke, so I bought three new ones off Amazon. Cheap ones, of course. See if I can get something better. See you in a bit. Uh, I found this and stuff I got for the lathe, so I've buffed off four squares now and it goes in. Uh, what I'm going to do is stick it in the lathe and turn it down so I can put the battery drill on the end of it. But keep a square as well. So 
I'll bring you back when I've got that done. Uh, I'm going to try and do a friction weld. Never tried it before, but we'll give it a bash. Yeah, it's whether I can get the lathe to run fast enough or not before it trips the motor. See what happens. Uh, high, high, high speed. That way. Right, that should be maximum speed. <laughs> I'll have to melt it up to speed. Uh, I tripped the motor. I'll have to wait till it cools down again. Does that. Um, it's the next speed down 430, I might manage that. Yeah, wait a minute before we can use it again. Right, uh, I'm going to centre bore it and put the pin in and weld it probably. <laughs> Drills here that should do the job. I don't know, I've done it with Verniers again. Oh, just found them. So, what size is our pin? Pin is 12.63. And that drill is 11. It's 12. Six and put it with the put it with the little one first, and then because there might be a bit of wiggle on it. Running around, it's got 66 we're looking for 1288 see if we can find a better one a slightly bigger one 1212 see how that'll do
other options, chop this up, turn this down a bit if I can't find a drill. Just watching my time today, I have to go and pick up a prescription for someone. So we're at 12.31. I have a cunning plan. Put it in, in the drill and spun it against the, the grindstone. I need a little bit more, but you can measure the device on that. Zero. Well, um, this hole here is. A push, it's about 12 30. Well, 60 to 30. That's about 1,000 small meters. That'll be a small meter off. Got a wee, wee bit tapered and a bit hot too. Just go in, I think. If you think what I'll do is I'll, I'll just pour a little deeper, that's all I'll do. And I can go in further. to weld it in there first and then sort it. If you keep watching after the credits I've put a link to a Scottish well-being site that can help you if you're in trouble in lockdown or you know in Covid and all that. Uh, for England if you just google it you should be able to find yeah, one down there as well and the same for Wales. Right, I think that's the we're going to get, but I'm just going to stop just now because I need to go and get this prescription. <laughs>